being said, those are some of the reasons why I like webinars. And the question that we had was, there's a system by a guy named uh, Casey Zeman, and it's really quite nice. It's called Easy Webinar Plugin. And I thought what I'd do is uh, just kind of show a little bit of the features and things like that. By the way, I am promoting this because I like it. And if anyone uh, wants to pick it up through my link, I'm going to go ahead and offer, I think I said like six months of these coaching. I don't know. Maybe I'll make it a year or whatever. You can check it out. I've used several of these webinar systems, like I say. I've been using GoToWebinar for like five years now. I pay 79 bucks a month for that, for a thousand seat. Now, anybody that knows the system will know that, is that a bargain? Anybody? <laughs> uh, 79 bucks a month for a thousand seat GoToWebinar? Yeah, I think it's, I'm not sure what it is, but I think it's like $500 a month for that. But I got grandfathered in because I've been there so long. But still, if you kind of price that out over five years, that's like half a car, you know? Um, so I got that. And then the other thing is that it, GoToWebinar doesn't really have a good funnel system. You know, you can't make nice-looking registration pages and event pages and replay pages. So to implement that all together, we use a system called Lead Pages which is awesome at that. I'm sure you've all seen lead pages in action, but that costs like 480 bucks a year. So when I saw Casey's product here, and I think, uh, I think it's like 397, one-time fee. And that at the end of their product launch, which is in like a couple of days, that's going to go to an annual fee. But for, for 400 bucks, this is a pretty nice little deal here. So what I like about it is, oh, we'll just go in and edit one of these for a second, just to kind of give you a quick idea. And this is kind of the way a lot of these types of systems work. Uh, but this is nice and clean. You can do a one-time event, and it integrates with Google Hangouts, but takes away a lot of that complexity. Uh, and you can also do reoccurring events, like I talked about before. It's just like a matter of filling out boxes and stuff. You go to the registration page. They have a lot of different themes and templates and stuff like that. And they're all mobile responsive. Uh, you know, so it's instead of lead pages at 480 bucks a year, you know, you can make some pretty nice looking uh, pages and stuff like that. Let's see. So I did a couple demos here. In fact, let's... Which brings me to one of the things that I didn't really like about it, or I think that is an issue. Uh, when I went to install it, it's best if you install it actually on a fresh WordPress install. It is a WordPress plugin. There are certain security and CAPTCHA plugins that just collide with it. I couldn't install it on my main Learn Camtasia site for example. Now the workaround there is actually a pretty simple one. I just didn't have time to implement it. And it's that you install a quick subdomain that's just for your webinars on your main site. And then at that point, what you can do is install basically a fresh WordPress installation. Okay, So, so as you can kind of see here, yeah, in fact, I'm just going to deactivate or delete these. Uh, so installing it on a existing WordPress installation may or may not work. Uh, I would recommend you follow their advice and install on a subdomain. But this is like a fresh install, right? So now if I go to, let's go to my dashboard. And let's just take a look. So here's one that I, it, I leveraged, again, an existing presentation. This was Bob the Teacher and me talking about how to do video planning with mind maps. It's an awesome little presentation. In fact, if you haven't seen it, let's get you a uh, registration link here. And I'll put that in the chat box. Now keep in mind, this is just a test right now. I, I haven't really dialed this in. So, but it creates the registration pages. I coded none of this. 
you know, you pick a template and then, you know, you say how many days of the week you want it to be available. I set it up so people can watch the replay right away. So it's like me being able to broadcast for folks at specific dates and times or they can watch it right away if they want. Enter your name and email address, registers them, and it puts them into basically, uh, you know, a nice little funnel. And I can make sure that they uh, get reminded. Uh, I can add them to my email list. And this particular one connects to AWeber. Uh, so, I mean, it's just, uh, you know, it's kind of a handy-dandy little thing. It's a couple of other features that are nice. So pick a registration page, fill out some information, and there are lots of templates and things like that. I get a registration page, I get a thank you page uh, that has built-in reminders and the ability to share the event. You can set up gifts so that if somebody shares your webinar registration page, they get like a free report or, you know, some kind of gift, whatever giveaway you want to do. This is a tactic that I'm really kind of excited to get going because sometimes getting attendees uh, is kind of tough, but this is kind of sweet. I like that. It integrates right with the Facebook APIs, so your co you know Facebook comments, all that good stuff. But this is the extent of the coding that you do right here. I think the main thing that I did was copy and paste my uh, AWeber form code uh, and there's good documentation on how to do all the Facebook stuff. It was simple. It really was quite simple. You can use a YouTube video as your event video. It's pretty sweet. I like it. Scarcity events. Uh, let's see what that looks So at a certain point in the video or the event you can have buy buttons appear or you know, click here to get your free download. Good stuff. So here's the extent of the coding I did. I just pasted my AWeber code in. Looks like it all works as advertised. I like it. Uh, like I mentioned, the, one of the reasons I brought it up specifically was that in the, in the grand scheme of webinar world, this is kind of a good deal. You know, like I say, I, I pay a lot of money for this, and I do it happily because it's the number one revenue generating thing in my business and certainly in a lot of other folks. Uh, Casey's been working on this for a long time in the sense that this is version 4. I've also used a system called the Evergreen Business System, which I started using like three or four years ago. And it's a decent system and it still works, but ah, it's just not quite as easy. And the thing that really kind of irritates me about it is they haven't updated it since like 2012 or 13, right? And I just hate that. <laughs> uh, Casey's been bringing out regular updates for this. Super sharp, wicked smart guy. And he's got a great team behind him. So that's another thing that kind of figures into my, uh, my process here. Uh, this particular page is what a properly crafted example looks like. So there you go. Don't have to code any of that stuff. If you do decide to pick this up, shoot a copy of your ClickBank receipt to me at lonnaylor at gmail.com and I'll hook you up with a whole bunch of extra screencast coaching access time. Take it easy and we'll see you all next time.